What's up guys and welcome back to Bully Scholarship Edition. It is day two, our first morning here at the Bullworth Academy. We're waking up, looks like it's just past 8 a.m. I believe we have class at 9.30, right? But uh, looks like we've got a mission right outside our door. Sometimes people will want you to run an errand for them. We'll have a blue arrow above their head and appear as an X on the radar. All right, what do you want, Petey? What do you got for me this morning, bro? So, I'm gonna need your help with this. Take Peter's package to Beatrice. All right, I'm down for it. Yeah, I'll do that okay. for you. Thanks. You got to crush your pity or what's what's the dealio? Complete the uh complete the errand by delivering the package. What's up, bro? How you doing? Good morning. So, we got to go deliver a package for Petey here. Might have a, a bit of a crush or something. I don't really know what's going on, but uh Let's go do it. Oh, looks like she's right here. Oh, she's cute. Cute little nerdy girl, all right. Yours truly, for my good friend, Peter. Jimmy comes through again. We tend to call him Tripod, just in case you're interested, you know, because he's he's got three, three limbs that could work his legs. Morning class about to start from 9 a.m. to 11.30 a.m. Yeah, dude, I, I think it's, uh... I think it's time to, to head in. Let's let's get this done. So where's our class at? Follow the bell. Looks like it's oh it's gonna be upstairs. Wonder what class we're gonna have today, huh? Should be uh should be an interesting new journey. I don't know if you have to always go to class or not. I feel like the classes are kind of fun. Ooh, this is art class. Okay. Gentlemen, I'm Miss Phillips, and it is my pleasure to induct you into the world of arts. We got a cheerleader in here. I see you. Art class instructions. Draw boxes with your pencil to expose the hidden picture. Claim as much of the canvas as possible without getting in the path of enemies. Enemies are floaters, crawlers, exploders, power-ups or speed, clear enemies, and freeze. Okay, so we want to hit the, the green hands and the bombs. Uh, all right. So this is essentially like, whoa. What the heck? Okay. Kind of interesting here. So you Hmm. This is very good. Have you ever been here? If you're offering, I'm down. Okay. So class is done. Hi there. You've earned the ability to exchange a gift for a kiss. Just a little something. Oh, Jimmy, that's so nice of you. You smell real good. <laughs> oh, get up in there, big dog. You're so bad. Uh. No problem. Kissing bonus unlocked. Girls always love the bad boys, bro. To get girls to kiss, you have to find flowers or chocolates that you can give to them. All right. Well, looks like we're getting ganged up on by a couple of numbskulls right now let's uh let's head out so we're gonna have our afternoon class but it seems like we should be able to to go do a main mission before then how you doing how you doing bro I'll, I'll come back and say hi to you bro nope you did you did not just bully my friend i will take you down oh shoot teachers are after me go 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 run back to the dorm run back to the dorm get the heck out of there nice hey what's up bro how you doing? Salutations. Could have sworn I just saw you over on the other side of the side of the yard, but let's see what we got going on here. A little help, dude. He's everywhere. Go on, Pete. Little help. Go cry to the teacher. Tell them I was nasty to you. Shut up, Gary. You're such a jerk, man. I don't oh, like Gary. Am I, Pete? Oh, you're so cutting. I'm really upset. Actually, I think I'm gonna go cry. Then I'd be just like you. Cry, little girl. Oh, look out. <laughs> Here comes Jimmy. Just knock it off, Gary. You're out of line. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't realize I was hanging out in the girls' dorm. Silly me. Shut up, man. You're boring. Boring? <laughs> I'm boring. You're none too interesting yourself, friend. <laughs> Look, I'm sorry, both of you. I apologize, okay? 
I just get a little overexcited. Forgive me. Forget it. It's cool. Anyway, I've got a good idea for some fun. Let's go out and torment someone really helpless and unfortunate. <laughs> that homeless guy. <laughs> no, uh, dude, come uh, on. Come on. You coming, little Petey? Come on, I'm sorry. I'll give you a kiss if that's what you want. Shut up. Then come on. Hey, bro, I already got my first kiss today. At least the one I earned, so I don't need any kisses over here. I don't like Gary, though, dude. He's a poser. He, he thinks he's so cool. He thinks he's so funny, and he's just not. I, he's a loser. There's, there's no doubt about that. Oh, the bus? We got to go over here for the bus, right? You got to go around the back side of the school. We shot the bus out with... Uh, with what's it called before? I'm gonna give this girl a compliment. What's up? I like tall doing? ladies. Wanna hang out? Sure. I'm bored out of my mind. Nice. You know, you smell really nice. Hey, you look nice. All right, I'll see you later. Mwah. Save some sugar for me later, baby. All right. So anyway, yeah, there's the the bus back here. Gotta find the homeless guy. Is he in? I think he's inside of it. Go in the bus. Man, I I can't is this him back here? I don't want to go terrorize a homeless man. This is so mean. Kind of fits our MO though, right? Just some bad kids. Where is this dirty old perv? You know, you're not very nice, Gary. And you're a loser, Petey. One of life's unfortunates. Get out of Whoa. here, you little scum! <laughs> He's drunk. <laughs> So I He's got guess a brick. rumors are true, Jimmy. Your dad does live on campus. You jerk! Ow! Let's leave this guy to his welfare payments. Come on, let's get out of here. Just get out of here, kid. Why should I? Because otherwise I'll kill you. What's your problem? <laughs> That's a long story. You got any liquor? No, I'm 15. Well, hmm. what about drugs? No. Then why shouldn't I kill you? All right then, tough guy, kill me. <laughs> you know what, kid? I like your style. You got guts. When I was on that ridge in Korea, watching my buddies get killed Aww. by friendly fire, I could have used somebody like you. Yeah? Thanks. But I bet you can't fight. You do me a favor, and I'll show you some real moves. Okay, I like the sound of that. Moves. Real special army stuff. Cool. Just some get karate me a kid stuff. my radio and I'll show you what the army taught me. What, like how to get shot by your own side? <laughs> exactly. All right. So it sounds like we've got a uh, another kind of little uh, errand to run for him. He wants us to get a transistor. Can I get through? I can't get through. Is there another way through over here? If you don't have what I want, you ain't getting no training. I'm trying to get through the bus, bro. Oh, there we go. All right. So a transistor, huh? Are we going to be able to get one back here in the auto shop or something? Probably going to have some greasers pretty upset with us back here. Where's that? Over here? If you were smart, you'd get the hell off our turn. Not bad. Here's the transistor right here. One out of six collected. Take it to the hobo. Okay, so it looks like there's quite a few of these, but I think we only need the one to be able to provide for this man's needs. So we'll get out of the greasers' territory here so they leave us alone. Oh, shoot. Do we have... Hold on. Do we have class? Do we need, we need to go to our bell. I'll come, I'll come back to the hobo later. I'm not missing class, bro. I'm not, I'm not skipping class, bro. I don't want to skip class. I want straight A's. It's important to me. Shoot. It's a 30, isn't it? It's a 30, isn't it? What do we have? PE? Are we going to have, P we're over in the athletic section? Oh boy. We're going to gym, huh? Shoot. We have to end our current task to be able to go to class. I got I mean I, I think I think we probably should. We're a little bit late, but we made it to class. We'll go back and deal with the hobo after. This rule require physical contact between you and your opponent. Don't any of you enjoy it? <laughs> Alright, man. 
I love touching dudes in spandex. Follow the instructions to learn new moves. So we can grapple. Oh, we can headbutt. Nice. Learn to headbutt, baby. Three hit charge combo. Ooh, okay, not bad. There we go. I feel bad for this kid that's that's talking about what an awful person he is. Defeat the fatty using your wrestling moves. I mean, that's that's pretty much how we do it there. <laughs> I'm so glad even my teachers are bullying me, dude. Are you kidding me? Truancy means you're skipping class. If a prefect busts you, I'll send you to class. That's fine. I, I, I wasn't trying to skip. I was just a little bit late, bro. It's, it's, it's all good. Okay, so now I guess I think we're gonna have to go back. We really oh shoot. Are you kidding me? Well Those guys are too big and too strong at this point. I don't think we're gonna be able to mess with them That was our two classes down for the day. I think we're gonna have to go all the way back to our dorm We're gonna have to restart our last mission Let me know what uh, what the the protocol is there like should we be focusing on classes. I feel like classes are kind of like a, a secondary objective, but at the same time they make the rest of the game much easier. Like we're learning to kiss people to, you know, get extra bonus health. We learn to like deal with people and talk better and, and, and kind of reason and, and stuff like that with them. So I feel like we need to try to hit classes as much as we can, but we got to time it right with our other missions. So. Go cry to the teacher. We'll go around, Tell we'll, we'll do this next. all again, and then I'll see you guys once we have the transistor part. All right, fellas, so we got the part, and uh, we're returning to our new father figure in our life. Thanks, kid. You're one of the good ones. Taking care of the homeless, baby. I got you, bro. So we got an uppercut now. I like it. So we learned a couple of new moves in PE, and we we learned a uh, a move from a homeless man. So it looks like every time we find a transistor, we can bring it back to him, and I bet he gives us better and better training. Nice, not too bad. So we really learned how to uh, how to fight today. That's pretty exciting. Let's see what our next venture has in store. What up, girl? How you doing? You all right? What's a girl gotta do to get something from her man? Make sure you're dressed nicely or girls won't want to kiss you. Shoot. All right, so she doesn't want to see me in my, my school uniform. We got to look a, a little bit better. I'm trying to find somebody a little bit better than Eunice anyway. You know what I mean? I'm not I'm not too worried about it. Looks like we've got a mission inside the girls' dorm. Are we going to be allowed to go in here? I feel like this should probably be... Oh, we're trespassing. So that! Biatch. Give it back. Or what? Or, well, just give it back. Are you threatening uh, me, Metal Mouth? No, I just, just give it back. You can't just steal things from me. <laughs> Unfortunately for you, my pig ugly friend, that is exactly what I can do. In fact, I can do anything I like in this place. Anything at all. Ciao, Spotty. Give it back. And you should stay out of the girl's dorm, you little perv. I see you undressing me with your eyes, sicko. You wish. Please, will you help me? Do I have to? Yes, it's vital. She's stolen my lab notes. Without them, I'm gonna fail chemistry and I'll never get into med school. Now I won't find the cure for cancer. Basically, the future of the whole world rests on those notes. What's in it for me? Well, if you get them back, I'll... I'll kiss you. Oh, uh, that's okay. Oh, well, okay, but... If you don't, I'll tell the whole school you're some kind of sad sicko who spies on girls getting changed in their dorm. Relax. Yeah, I don't want to... One set of lab notes coming up. I don't want to deal with that. Girls like this, though, always the ones that end up being super hot, like, after high school. You know what I mean? It's uh, The girls that are hot in high school usually don't stay on that trend. I'm not surprised. 
You know, you should put a stink bomb in there. It'd be funny. Get one from Fatty. He knows everything about stinking. <laughs> That's really sad. All right, let's go talk to Fatty about stinking. Dude, this is so bad. <laughs> I mean, from what I remember, school was, was never this bad. There weren't this many bullies. I mean, it happens. And some people were, were more popular than others and whatever else. There were clicks and stuff. But, oh, what's up? Are you trying to talk to me? What's up, girl? How you doing? I don't have any roses to give to you. Sorry. Ooh, what is this? Stink bombs. Nice. Apparently, I was supposed to talk to Fatty, but I already found stink bombs. So now we can just go to the gym and uh, we're going to let her rip, huh? What are how you normally get stink bombs? I really hope we didn't mess something up there. You know what I mean? Like, I feel like... We missed a, a tutorial event or something, but uh, it's gonna be fine. We'll, we'll figure it out. So we're going back to where we had our gym class today. And let's uh, break into Mandy's locker and get the lab notes. And then we're gonna stink the thing up. Shoot, gotta make sure nobody's in here. We're trespassing, uh-oh. How you doing, girl? Don't say anything to anyone, please. Ooh, ooh, ooh. There's teachers coming. Hold on. There's girls in here. No way, dude. So she went and told the teacher. Is he going to turn around again? She gonna go tell him again? Hold on. She's probably gonna go tell him again. We'll keep an eye on it. All right, let's let's start getting after it here. Got him. Let me grab these notes real quick. Throw the stink bomb in there, and I'm out. Return the lab notes to Beatrice. Let's go, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Right from underneath his nose while he was sitting there. Oh, I love it, bro. Beautiful work. Your boy is out here after dark. Getting it done. Laying down the law. Good stuff, Jimmy. I wish I had some flowers, girl. Also, what? <laughs> wow, did you get a nose job or something? What kind of a compliment is that? That's not a compliment. We gotta, we gotta work on the game, Jimmy. I don't know where we. Oh shoot! I do know where we. Let me pick. Pick tons of flowers here, bro. I'm about to pick all the flowers. We're gonna have so many flowers to give to girls. It's gonna be outrageous. Do you get to keep multiple, or uh, I'm not really sure how it works. I'm gonna go back. We gotta find this girl. We gotta find this girl. We gotta find this girl. Where'd you go, girl? Tall, them long legs, looking like a model. Where's she at? She always spawns in this area. I'm really hoping we can find her again. She's the love of my life. I don't see her, though. Shoot. Okay, well, at least we'll be prepared for next time she comes around. Wait, is this her? Is that her? I don't think that's her. I mean, I might as well spit some game. Killing it! I, I kind of like the redheaded girl, though. Not, not gonna lie. I haven't seen any blondes. I'm, I'm partial to blondes, that's for sure. But, uh... We'll, we'll make it work. Oh, what up, girl? Hey, how you doing? So, are you gonna get me something nice? <laughs> I love how she wants chocolates. All the other girls want flowers, but she wants chocolates. Whoa, 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 whoa. How, how are we so... Oh, th that was our girlfriend. How are we supposed to deliver the notes back? Oh, shoot, we're out pa past dark. <gasps> Who is that? Here you go. Making out oh, on the side of the girl's Jimmy, dorm. You're wonderful. Come on, give me a kiss. Beatrice now likes you. Bro, for real, she's... 
She's a little cutie, and she's smart. She wants to go to med school. Nice work, Your Jim. boy's about to be a sugar yes, I baby. This girl likes you. She will always accept your gifts and want to kiss you. Well, I'm gonna go pick pick some more flowers. I don't know if we can like pick multiples or how that works. I think you might only be able to hold one at a time, but uh, that was that was pretty good. It actually it looks like we might have another mission with Beatrice here. So do we? Do we primarily want to run missions at night and do our schoolwork during the day? Hey, Beatrice, what's wrong? Two things. Firstly, my cold sores are totally acting up what? again. What? Ew, gross. Just Secondly, a little herpes, no big deal. Mr. Hattrick saw me writing in my diary during class, and he took it and he locked it in his desk. And he says he's going to give it to the principal tomorrow. If anyone sees what's in there, I will just die. It's really personal. Yeah, well, nothing like having the whole school know your deepest secrets. Makes your teenage years go by in a flash. Yeah, well, you'll soon find out. Me? Why? In the diary, I talk a lot about you and me. What? There is no you and me. Yeah, there is, yeah, Jimmy. Don't yeah, fight there it. there is. See, first you rescued my notes from Mandy, and... Then we fell in love, and oh, you brought me flowers, what? and wrote me poetry, and showed this kinder, sensitive side that soon the whole world is gonna know about. We're like doomed lovers. Enough! Okay, I'll get your book back. <laughs> then we can kiss. The cold sores aren't contagious once they start to scab over. I mean, that's a risk I'm willing to take. Enter the school through the rear window. Whew, all right. We gotta start using these shortcuts. I haven't really been using the shortcuts. Um, for real though, dude. I don't know if any of you guys are are in school currently. You know, high school, that sort of thing. Don't don't pass up on the ones that not everybody is going for right now, because oftentimes puberty and everything is, is much kinder to them without a doubt. How are we supposed to enter? It's up on the second store. Oh, oh, that's a like a flower grate we can. We can climb right there. Here we go. Feeling pretty good. We kissed three different girls. We've got our first uh, our first true girlfriend. We've got a G&G &G collectible card. We're gonna go in through the rear window here. Breaking and entering. Shh. Check out the math room. We gotta get to the, What what are the odds of that, bro? We got away from him though. We're good to go. We got that endurance, baby. Go ahead and head in the math room here. Can we go inside? Locked. Check the staff room. Staff room is gonna be out and downstairs. Okay. Just keep running, Trev. Just keep running, Trev. Lead him in a circle. You just got away from him. Perfect. Literally led the guy downstairs that was going to get you upstairs, and now he's going to be stuck up there. We're good. We're in here. Okay. So we got to sneak into his desk. We got to grab the diary. World's not going to find out about us yet, lady. That new Jimmy boy is so bad. Bad teeth, bad hair, bad smell. Bad attitude. And yet there's just something about him that's so alluring. I told Becky about Bucky, about how I felt. He didn't seem happy at all. That makes me a little sad because Bucky's been such a great friend. I'd hate to think that something or someone in his life is not treating him well. Well, it's probably because he likes you and you're friend zoning him. Oh, I knew it. I walked by him today and he looked at me. He's such a free radical. How I'd love to pair his electrons. The whole thought of us making sweet organic chemistry just sends shivers down my spine. Love it. Run with it, Jimmy. I love this. I love this for you, bro. Oh, we are not getting caught with the with the, the book. We got we got to go, bro. We got to go right now. And we are gonna go deliver this back to her. Oh shoot, we got a nerd being beat up. I mean I I could try to. I thought he was gonna get mad at us for being out too late or something. But uh, I guess we're good. Oh, 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 here she is. Hey, wanna help the, me with the tall, my... hot redhead. Have something special for me? I hope you think this is okay. This is so sweet. Right in front of her, bro. 
Like a savage! I've heard like 10 people made out here. Like a savage, bro. And now I'm gonna go kiss the other girl too. <laughs> And she gave us 20 bucks, bro. As I'd expected. I'll be your little errand boy any day of the week. Increase study time to 35 hours per week, eat lunch while walking. That's 30 minutes per meal. If I can't be a physician, I guess I could be a lawyer, but... Okay, she's insane. Um, so is there... Is there, like... Should we be sleeping? I feel like we're doing all these missions at night, and that's really convenient, because then it doesn't get in the way of our classes. But at the same time, like, I, I don't know if sleep is important. I kind of feel like sleep's probably important. I mean, for the time Sorry. being, we're just gonna keep grinding. Sorry about that. Out. Stop, Defend Barry. Bucky. Mm. Trying to watch this. Uh, Is that the dude we're team. cucking? Intellectual stuff. So tell me, Petey, do you Come like on. watching the girls in their swimming costumes? Does Get that fuel your filthy little fantasy? Get swimming costumes? Oh, Marion, show me your breaststroke again. Or. Wait, do you like the boys on the team? Yeah, right, Gary. Which is it, Petey? I see you guys are getting along as usual. I'm just toughening ow, him up. Ow. Turning him into a man or a woman or something. It's 2020, bro. Hey, We're Jimmy. all inclusive. Hey, Petey. Ah, peace stain. Good to see you. Listen, Jimmy, I need a favor. Bucky went to the auto shop to get some parts for his science projects. He hasn't come back yet. I think he might be in trouble. Please? Why don't you go yourself? I've got homework. <laughs> okay, I'm frightened. And I've got a weak bladder. <laughs> yeah, yeah you do. We learned that. Him. Please, I'll pay. I say do it. It's a good chance to show Russell who's in charge around here. Now run along, Ow. peace stain, before you mark the carpet. Yes. We've got to take care of Russell and his boys. Then, after that, take care of all the other cliques. Soon, this school will be ours. I don't want the school. Yeah, well, I do, pal, and I intend to get it. Now go help that door. And what are you gonna do? I've got planning to do. He's not gonna do anything because he's a loser. Off. Sorry. Boop. Stop. And he can't do anything. Sorry. So this is kind of sad, though. Bucky is the one that she wrote about in her, uh, in her journal. So Bucky is very clearly, you know, infatuated with this girl. He likes this girl. So we stole his girl and now we're gonna go save him from his demise. Oh, what's up, girl? How you, you got doing? Some free time, baby? Can you give me something that will remind me of you? Of course I, I like can. This. I'm really touched. I can't wait to graduate so I can do that all the time. <laughs> Bro, there's no way they're gonna get a cat fight over. <laughs> Bucky's dying. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. We gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta go. Bucky's in trouble. Oh shoot, we're violating curfew. So curfew kicks in at 11 p.m. Come on, Bucky, fight back. Protect Bucky from the bullies. Out of here, boys. Straight waxing these fools. Beautiful. Can I pick this thing up? Help Bucky get into the garage. I'm gonna drink this soda. I, I don't know how to pick things up. I have no clue how to pick things up. I thought you just ran over stuff, but it, it never works. Okay. Anyway, let's get in this garage, Bucky. Gonna take care of the guy with the bat first. Feel like our our triple hit is usually the the best one. Nice. Kick him while he's down. Grab him, throw him to the ground. Oh, full mount him and just go to pound town. Help Bucky get into the garage. We have full health, so I don't, maybe that's why we can't use it. Help Bucky escape the auto shop area. All right. Looks like we got a couple of other. Ooh. A couple of other bad guys here. Nope. Hang in there, Bucky. I got you, bro. I like throwing him on the ground and just... Gah, gah, gah. Straight on top of a missionary style, baby. What is this? Can I pick this up? Skateboard? That's cool. Damn it, kid! Keep it down! It's 
the homeless guy. <laughs> We're friends, bro. Nice to know there's a violent, crazy old man on campus. Thanks, Timmy. That's great. Here, take this. You earned the skateboard. Nerd respect plus five. Okay. Jimmy Hopkins delivers. Press LB and RB together to equip and unequip your skateboard. No way, dude. So th is this like a, almost like a sprint button or like a fast travel button? Oh, okay. Well. Gave him a nice, a ni oh, we can ollie? Nice. Gave him a nice little crotch grab there, able to get away from him. We're just gonna skate on back home. So all of our missions are done and we can we can call that, oh, well. I mean, that was actually kind of smooth. We can call that a wrap on the day. It's just past midnight and we got it done, baby. Oh my goodness, dude, that was, that was an awesome day. I had a lot of fun. So let's go ahead and save here. And we're gonna be able to hit the sheets and uh, here we are, day number three. Waking back up and uh, let's get out and get after it. We've got class in the mornings as always, so probably gonna head straight there. I guess we could kind of scope out our first mission if we want, but I feel like that's probably gonna be our best, uh, our best kind of way of doing things. Oh, what's up, girl? You're sweet. It would be nice if you showed your interest in me by Hello, presenting me with a gift. Of so is life. is this the you same like girl? Because I feel like there's multiples of the different people. I have not ever? I've been you thinking look great, about human like... sexuality. I've been thinking about human sexuality. So have I. Let's let's go, you know, maybe think about that together later. But um yeah, I feel like a lot of the the girls it's like you'll you'll see multiple of the same but it's not the same girls, you know what I mean? Like that she she wasn't acting like we were a thing like she had been lately. So anyway, we're going to head off to class. Let me know, for those of you guys who have played it, but is that a pretty good strategy that we kind of do class throughout the days and then, uh, you know, when we when we have like one mission in between two classes and then after school is when we do our main missions. What's up, girl? What are you looking for? I hear you're mechanically apt, but I'm not sure I believe it. Uh, not right now. I got class to get to. We might be able to talk later. To be honest, I'm not too concerned with, uh, with your request. Biology, huh? Let's... Let's get after it. This should be fun. Hello, children. Welcome to the world of biology. I hope you all have strong stomachs. Hmm. Complete the dissection as accurately as possible before class ends. Aim the pointer. A or right trigger to select and identify. Hold to use. RB slows the pointer. Okay. Um. Alright. I hope we could do this. What, what are we what are we supposed to do pins to secure the frog to the tray? Let me can I put this back? I want to get this okay pin okay Pin all right pin And pin okay now use a scalpel to make an incision so we're gonna grab our scalpel and We're gonna start it here Go straight down the frog. I actually never did this in uh in school. Nice. Use a scalpel to make an incision down along the bottom here. Gotta get between those two. Use the forceps to peel back the skin flaps. Wow, this is, this is lovely. Use the pins to secure them, okay. So we're gonna pin that, we're gonna pin that. Now what are we going to do? Use the magnifying glass to identify the heart, which is going to be right here, right? Use the scalpel to cut around the heart. Okay. So we're going to try to cut this heart out. Take your time, boy. Dissection is an art. Got to use that, that slowing tool. I mean, old school game with old school controller doesn't really work all that well. Use the forceps to remove the heart. Hold A to drag it. All right, so we're going to grab these forceps. We're going to put it over here. Beautiful. Identify the stomach with the magnifying glass, which is going to be here, right? I believe. Yep. All right. Now we're going to grab our scalpel. Love the, the noises that are coming out of this for sure. So do we just want to touch each one of these where it's... Remember, slow and steady wins the race. Okay. 
Low and slow, baby, just like uh, just like SnowRunner. Beautiful. Now we're going to uh, use the forceps to, to pull that out. Beautiful. Identify the intestines. Intestines are going to be these things right here. Now we're going to we're going to pull these out, cut around the intestines. We're at 86%. We got to get at least a 90, bro. Patience, Hopkins. You can't rush science. I'm a straight A type of type of guy. Straight A type of guy. Beautiful. Now we're going to grab these. Pull the intestines out. Yes! Let's see if you can keep it up. All right. I like the mini games of the classes. If you want me to be honest, go to classes. One of my favorite parts about this series. Muscle shirts been unlocked. Oh, the girls are going to love that, huh? The candidate. Let's see what's going on here. Ernest is looking to become class president. Move, nerd! <laughs> How original. Call me a nerd. What next? Four eyes? Sticks and stones may break my bones, but words will never hurt All me! Alright, you oh. ass boy. What's this? Class... Press... <laughs> class president, dummy. It says class president. I don't know. That's I don't you? Know. I'm the most suitable candidate I know! <laughs> yeah, so's your mom. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Don't forget to wipe. <laughs> How's the campaign, Ernest? You'll vote for me, won't you? Yeah, not a chance. What if I pay you? Pay me? Now you're talking. I always knew I was a born leader. <laughs> yeah, but unless you buy everyone's vote, you're never gonna win. Because they are definitely gonna ruin your speech at the debate. Unless I had a security manager. Oh, oh please, I can handle please, that. Please, I don't know. Please, security please, managers, they please. cost a lot of money. Oh, I have money. I can pay you. Good. I've always been a politician at heart. Corrupt, too. Perfect. Go to the auditorium balcony. Ernest's speech is about to begin. Okay. I really hope we're not going to be late for class on this. Last time we tried to do something in between, we kind of messed it up. But we're, we're fine. We made it. We, we should be good. Long as his speech doesn't take too much time. Keep Ernest safe for the duration of his speech. Oh, are we going to have to use our slingshot or something? I bet we're going to have to use our slingshot. Welcome. So if anybody starts to move. Words, my friends. This school needs help. What's up, Maggie? My help. How many of you out there feel abused by society? Let down by the establishment. Just sniping these fools. Brutalized. I feel your pain, my children. Do not despair. Salvation is here, my friends. Why do you even try? By choosing me as your leader, we will usher in a new. These kids are ridiculous, bro. Oh shoot, he's up on top. Yeah, got him. They like him, I like it. I'm actually really kind of enjoying this, bro. I'm his Chris Kyle, man. Taking him. Oh. My bad. I got you, Ernest. I let up once. We're going to pay attention to the, the mini map, mostly. Not really rely on visuals. Mini map's more important. Got him in the kneecap. Come on, Ernest, you got this, bro. Just doesn't have what it takes to be president. Some claim I don't represent the masses. Let me tell you. Nice. I'm gonna kick your ass. I've been beat up just as much as you. It's time for a change for the better. Suck on this. A vote for Ernest means a vote for you suck. 
the triumph of brains over brains over broad all day baby I, I believe Ernest I believe in you in closing, remember, a vote for e is a vote for me means a vote for me. Oh. thank you everyone yeah. hey our girl was there <laughs> it's literally all nerds and then like one of each other group okay got ten bucks for being his campaign security manager there, and we got the super slingshot. On Jimmy. Nice. You can get extra zoom ins. All right, that's what I'm talking about. So these side missions truly do kind of make a difference. Like you, you, you. I mean, that, that was a main mission, but like a lot of these missions were ending up getting getting some pretty cool stuff. Let's see what's going on with this girl. I hear you're mechanically apt, but I'm not sure I believe it. Care to prove sure. Me wrong? Sure thing. Here we go. All right, so we just gotta go pick three lockers. Gotta watch out for the uh, the staff walking around. Let me go ahead and oh, that's that's a hide. I want to pick it. I'm pretty clever. I want to pick it. So the blue ones must be hiding, and the red ones you can probably pick. All right. Wait. Wait for him to go away. We're fine. We gotta cut kind of away. I'm, I'm trying to blow time until our next class. I don't know if we could get another mission before our next class. Here we go. There it is. Just like that. Bullworth Letterman jacket. All right, we're gonna be able to put some fresh clothes on to, to kind of meet some ladies and get to know them a little bit better, which is exciting. I'm gonna go over to this side here. See if there's anything that we can pick over yonder. Hmm. Looks like there's one right here. I don't think we're gonna be able to do it quick enough. We gotta wait for this guy to go. Dude, they're at the wrong spot every single time, of course. Just wait for this guy to go by, nothing to see here. Oh, that's disgusting, bro. You better go wash your hands, sing happy birthday twice. Ain't nobody try to, try to catch that nonsense. Here we go. All right, locker number two. Sometimes they're pretty easy. Sometimes you go way farther than you would expect. We got a box of chocolates. Gonna be able to kiss Eunice again if we ever decide that we want to. And now we've got to do one more locker. I'm assuming we're just gonna go upstairs and get one. Looks like there's one right here. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Got him. Get out of that locker quick. Another box of chocolates. Moving on to our next main hey, mission here, it's on? Halloween. Not much. I was just lying here wishing I could be more like you. Yeah, whatever. But I'm cursed. Yeah. For the skull really. trooper. <laughs> yeah. Cursed by brains. Do you know what torture it is to be thinking all the time? No, of course you don't. Yeah, you're cursed. You're great. Whatever. What else is going on? Not much. Let me see. Uh, it's Halloween. All the prefects are at some party and the teachers are entertaining, I use that word loosely, the kids. No, I'd say the opportunities for fun are pretty much nil. What do you have in mind? Come on, you'll see. Gonna get into a little bit of trouble tonight. Find some pranks to play. All right, this is gonna be kind of fun. I love how he's in a skull trooper outfit almost perfectly. Find some pranks to play on students. Folly X to get pranks you can play on other students. So let's let's hear this. Slap a student with a kick me sign. Get close to one of the students and hold LT to target them. What about this girl? Got him! <laughs> Threw a kick me sign on a kid, okay. Well, that, I mean, that that's good enough. Let's go see, let's see what this guy has. Egg three students. All right, I'm down for that. We got a carton of eggs. So we're just going to uh, throw some eggs at some people. Got him, there's three. Two out of five pranks are complete. Dude, this is so mean. Just straight mean-spirited. No, no, like, fun in these pranks. It's just awful. Light Volcano 4000 near some students. Yeah, all right, let's do it. Okay. 
Get close to some students, press RT to light and drop it. So let's go find some students. Oh, look at this. It's a SpaceX astronaut. Does it do anything? <laughs> All right, I'll take that. Blew up in their faces, hit three students with stink bombs. Give me them stink bombs, I can make this happen. Okay, I'm in. Got some stink bombs. Ooh, probably shouldn't hit the greasers, huh? Got him. <laughs> Be a virgin until I die. Yeah, if you're acting like this, it's not, not far from the truth, gonna be honest. Pumpkin head over here, what do we have? Trip a student with marbles. So we got a bag of marbles, and now we want to, uh, I mean, how do we, how do we actually do it? <laughs> we got him and got myself, and now we've unlocked the big plank, the big prank. Only available on Halloween night. Sleep and you'll lose your chance to complete it. All right, well, let's go do the big prank. Let's see what this is all about. Should we try to find some ladies? Ooh, what's up, girl? How you doing? Oh, hey. I have to go call my mom. Bye. Oh, well, I I guess that that's that's a no. She's, she's not interested. They're probably not really happy with the fact that I'm terrorizing the school. All right, the big prank. Here we go. Okay, here's the deal. We're gonna feed Chad's dog some of the no. meat. Wait for him to take a dump, and then what the hell? I'm out of here. Whatever, Pete. Okay, let's do this, Jim. I'll explain the rest later. That's really mean. Get over here, you little mutt. Hey. Protect Gary from Chad. All right. Get out of here, Chad. Come here. Oh shoot. Dude, he's kind of a big dude. We're gonna be able to we're gonna be able to take him down though. Take him down to the ground. He's knocked out. Here you go, boy. How about a little trick for a treat? Yum 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 yum. So we're gonna get some really nasty, That's disgusting. Gross. What's the plan here? Did he just pick that up barehanded? All right, let's go to the teacher's lounge. You lead now we're gonna go to the teacher's lounge. Something tells me this is gonna be a really, really bad idea if we get caught, so we gotta be careful here. I don't think any of these girls want anything to do with us currently either. So we gotta, gotta be wary of that. All right, so we're in here, we're trespassing. Although it's... Supposed to be empty. The teachers should be off somewhere else. So we're gonna go throw this in the staff room. Don't worry, it'll be funny. Pull the fire alarm. Where's the fire alarm? Back here. I know this prank. They're gonna come out and stomp on it. What the devil is going on out here? The PE teacher. And I, oh shoot, I was gonna say, I guess that's a wrap. Oh shoot, they're coming after us. I'm gone, bro, I'm gone. It's a good thing I've been, I've been acing PE, dog. My, uh, my endurance is, is through the roof. Okay, well, I guess that's all we can do. Halloween night, bit of a fright, not gonna lie. Didn't, uh, I mean, it went well for us, but, you know, socially people are a little upset and the teachers probably knew, it. I don't know, we have a pretty good mask on, so they might not know. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, let's let's change our clothes back. I'm gonna look for the uh, I'm gonna look for the school uniform outfit. Just don't don't want to get in any trouble or anything. Let's go ahead and uh, let's let's hit the sheets, man. So it's the next morning here. We are heading into our uh, our first class of the day. Let's go learn. Let's go be a model student. Let's go uh, you know get some good grades and stuff. Looks like we're going back to chemistry. This one was fun. This is our first class we went to. Speaking of Kim too, bro, we haven't we haven't seen our girlfriend in forever. Where is she? Almost done. Feel like it's uh, you know, all all yesterday we didn't see her at all. Not really a good thing. Looking pretty good so far. Cooking it up in the pot, boy. Look at that. Kim 2 complete. We passed. 
stink bombs are now available from your chem set. So can we go into the chem lab and like make them? If so, that's that's pretty cool. All right. So I'm, I'm feeling pretty good. I'm liking where we're at. I'm thinking we should probably, I mean, we got some time till our afternoon class. We didn't even have an afternoon class in the, the Halloween day. Probably because it kind of let us out early. Ooh, what's up? What's up, girl? I got something for you. Oh, Jimmy, that's so nice of you. Hey, Jimmy. Um. <laughs> I've been wanting to somebody wants to be handicapped. <laughs> somebody wants to be handicapped. I don't know why I'm, I'm I'm just kissing all the girls in this game. All right, let's let's go. Got a blast, lady. I got I got some work to do. I'm I'm trying not to miss my my second class of the day. All right. So we're gonna head on in here. And it looks like we are going to be helping Gary. I don't like helping Gary. I don't like Gary. <laughs> Gary's a weirdo. <laughs> there you are. Come on, I found something incredible. Hold on, relax, man. I can't keep getting in trouble. I can't get expelled again. It's always about me with you. Me, me, me. I'm thinking bigger picture, and you're worrying about getting into trouble? You know what? You really are something. What bigger picture? I'm, uh, we are gonna take over this school. We are not taking over anything right now. Time and tide wait for no man, my friend. But it seems they do wait for a wannabe tough guy who's nothing but a little girl. You're full of it. So you keep telling me, look, now come on, I promise you, after this, things are never going to be the same I again. hope you're right. Oh, I'm so excited. I should have stopped taking those pills oh, ages no. ago. Yeah, right. Whatever you say, Gary. Stop this medication. He's going crazy. He's going to have some crazy ideas. Let's see, see what he has in mind. Leading us off into trouble. Oh, what's up, my lady? Hey, sweet cheeks. I like receiving presents. It Just wanted to show you I care. <laughs> Thank you. That's very nice. Good seeing you, girl. I think. Hi there. Come on. I promise I haven't been locking lips with anybody else. That was exactly as I expected. Oh, you know. But came came with a little side of mono too, so you're welcome. All right, here we go. Looks like we're going over to the greasers part of town, like the auto mechanic shop, kind of over. All right, help Gary take the bullies down. Let's work on it. I love how you can hit two at once sometimes. It's pretty great. Just straight mopping these fools up. Look at this teamwork, baby. Get him down on the ground and just start wailing, bro. Don't even let him up. Don't even let him think. Don't let him breathe. Don't let him do anything. Meet Gary by the basement. All right. Where are we going now? After you. The school basement. I don't know if I like this. What's down here? This is a little different from how I remember it. You better lead the way. Okay. Hmm, I think that switch over there. Can't have a Would you hurry there, Jimmy? This is just a little bit creepy. That cage wasn't locked before. You want me to What can I do? Can go through here? Is there a way for me to like pick the lock or something? How about you climb through that hole and press the switch? What hole? Oh, right here. All right. So we got that. And action. you're really gonna like this, Jimmy. I hope so, dude. You're kind of you, you're making me feel a little weird here. We can't get in there. How can we get at the switch? Switch. Um. Hmm. I mean, I can't. Hey Jimmy, see if you can knock the broom over somehow. Make oh, it okay. You're really gonna like this, Jimmy. Okay. Now here's another switch I used to. Whoa, live wires. Well, it looks like we might be able to go through here. Looks like I'll have to hold this down to get the power while you climb through and get the switch. All right. Got the switch, bro. Almost there. Make sure you keep that power down, otherwise we're gonna get fried out here. Nice work, Jimmy. Huh. A steam leak. 
I've heard of those happening, but I've never seen one. So we should probably grab the fire. Oh, oh nice. Let's take the fire extinguisher. Let's put this out. Oh, there's a fire extinguisher in plain view. Maybe that quick before it heats up again. I still have no idea where you're you're taking me, bro. Oh shoot. Okay. Didn't mean to go to my skateboard, that's for sure. Let's just try to get back to my my hands. Looks like we're late for class, boys. It's right down there. That's unfortunate. So, Jimmy boy, here we are. The hole. The place where this school separates the men from the boys. The wheat from the chaff and all that nonsense. Okay, so what's that got to do with standing up to people? Keeping them in line? This is where I stand up to you, my friend. What are you talking about? I know you yeah, I do. Jimmy boy. I know you said all that stuff about me behind my back. What are you talking about? Don't play innocent with me. You want to run this school? I want to run this school. Only one of us is going to make it. And it's going to be me. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and morons. God, I, I hate this kid, dude. Russell! So you're oh, gonna be man. the champion, but you can't Russell. stand up your, up for yourself. Because you don't have a spine. Russell, go beat that little jerk who said that nasty stuff to me about your mom and those boys. And he's making stuff what? up. What? Come here. Russell wants vengeance. This is I, this is so annoying. Let's go, Russell. I'm gonna You're a moron. I'm gonna, gonna talk some Okay! gonna say gonna talk some some trash to him let's get up Jimmy so it's clear that we we kind of when he does the charge thing we probably want to get out of the way Ooh. okay let's go you suck. You suck. Charity case. I love calling him names dude all right we got him about half health All right, we gotta take our licks and we gotta run, bro. 100%. No! Got him! Let's go, baby! Kick him while he's down! Kick him in the nuts! You happy now, jerk? Ecstatic! I love to watch two morons beat the crap out of each other. Why'd you do it, Gary? I thought we were friends. <laughs> Friends, you and me. I've taken <laughs> dumps that had more brains than you, friend. No, I'm taking over this school, and you're just a liability. See you around, moron. Well done, Jimmy. I yeah, always great. stood up for you, Petey. What a waste of time. You all right, Russell? Oh. I never said those things about yeah. you, bro. Look, I never said anything about your mom or farmyard animals. You did it? No, but I want you to stop bullying weak kids. Why? Ah, because there are a bunch of kids around this place who need a beating, and you're picking on the few who don't. So I want you to leave me and him alone. Oh, Petey's alone. on our side still. Oh, okay. Sorry. Bad Russell. I'm gonna be late for class, man. With Russell pacified, I could be forgiven for thinking my troubles at Bullworth were over. But this place is a rotten onion. Peel off one stinking layer, and there's another even smellier one beneath. Sounds pretty enticing to me. Well, Jimmy, word on the street is you're something of a pugilist. No, sir. I never pugilized in my life. Really? And that you've been saying some entertaining things about me and some barnyard animals? No, I never said that. Well, I listen to things, Hopkins. You try and stay out of trouble. Now go see the cook down in the kitchen. Helping her might teach you some humility. Okay, sir. Man. Hey, new kid. You're that guy that beat up Russell. So, what's it to you? Hey, listen, we like to box the noble art and all that. Why don't you come down by our gym in old Bullworth Vale? We should definitely hang out. Yeah, I've heard a lot of things about you. Yeah, whatever. Oh. Okay. So I mean, 
Our old life has been kind of turned upside down, but it seems like we might be making some new friends and things might actually end up working out for us. Oh, I got some flowers for you, baby. Look at this. We still got the ladies. Look at that little kid walking by. You ain't never so <laughs> Oh, poor kid fell on a banana and ran away. <laughs> we were making out with a chick. I'm sorry, bro. It sucks to be at the bottom of the social totem pole. So, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed. That was, uh... I mean, that was pretty crazy. I enjoyed it. I had a good time. Oh, do we have do we have class right? We don't have class right now, do we? We do have class right now. Shoot. Okay. I'm going to go back. I'm going to save. I'm going to see you guys in the next episode. We're going to take on class, take on potential new friendships, and, uh, and kind of do our thing. So, I'll see you guys there. Drop a like if you guys enjoy it. Drop a like if you guys want, uh, want more of this series, if you want it quickly, if you want daily uploads. And uh, I'll catch you guys later.